They're getting decimated. Strongest military in the galaxy, and the Reapers are obliterating it. Was it like this on Earth? Yes. Shepard. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Commander, the LZ's getting swarmed. James, open that hatch.
Sergeant Bardas, find a way to get that comm tower operational. Sir! General? Commander Shepard, heard you were coming, but I didn't believe it. General Corinthus. I've come to get Primarch Fedorian. Primarch Fedorian is dead. His shuttle was shot down an hour ago as it tried to leave the moon. That's gonna complicate things. How bad is it, General? We just lost about 400 men in half an hour. We set up camps on this moon as an advanced position to flank the enemy. A sound strategy. Just... Irrelevant. Exactly. The sheer force of the Reapers seems to make them immune to that sort of tactic. The Primarch and his men found that out the hard way. I'm sorry. That's a big loss for everyone. Bastards. So what happens now? The Turian hierarchy provides very clear lines of succession. Right. General Corinthus? With such heavy casualties, it's hard for me to be certain who the next Primarch is. Palavan Command will know. However, at the moment, contacting them is impossible. The comm tower is out. Husks are swarming that area. We can't get close enough to repair it. Well, I'm not leaving this moon until I know where the Primarch is. I'll fix your tower. Thank you, Commander. I'll take care of things on this end. All right, let's go. To the left of the main barricade in front of the tower. Sir, let's go. Minor mechanics has not arrived. Up and on your left, the main barricade. <laughs> Climbing up behind me, I'd appreciate it. Here they come. Ready, James? Uh, hell yeah! Let's take it!
operational. Much appreciated, Commander. I'll contact Palavin Command. Let me know when you've got something. I'll help your men till I hear from you. Understood. Shepard out. I have news. I'm listening. After sifting through people who are dead or MIA, Palavin Command tells me the new Primarch is General Adrian Victus. Victus? His name's crossed my desk. He's currently on this moon, on the front lines. We're attempting to contact him. However, you may not be happy. He has a reputation for being a maverick, for playing loose with accepted strategy. What do you mean? On Tetris, during the uprisings, his squad discovered a Salarian spy ring about the same time the Turian said. Rather than neutralize the ring, he fell back. He even gave... Then the rebels attacked the Salarians, and when both groups had worn each other down, Victus moved back in. Bold strategy, but wild behavior doesn't get you advanced up the meritocracy. Unconventional thinking might be the only way to save Palavin. And Earth. We need Turian resources. I don't care what it takes. Well then, he might be your man. I hope it works. General, sir, I still can't raise him. Let me have a look. Yes, sir. Commander! Shepard, come in! Can this wait, Joker? We're in the middle of a war zone. We've got a situation on the Normandy, Commander. It's like she's possessed. Shutting down systems, powering up weapons. I can't find the source. Hang tight, Joker. I'll be back as soon as I can. Incoming Harvester! <laughs> General, tell Primarch Victus we'll rendezvous here. Come on, let's go hit this bad boy. I'll radio you as soon as I've contacted our new Primarch. Right, let's go. <clears throat> James, that's you breathing so hard?
I think we're done here. Primark. Still can't get a stable comm link. Okay, I'm going on foot. Head toward the planet. Got it. Shepard out. Let's go find our Primark. How far, Shepard? He said to head for the planet. Looks like it should be quick unless we find trouble. How many people? Oh my god. Just look at Palavin. The Turians may not make it. How bad is it? Three million lost the first day, five the second. I hope we're doing better back on Earth. Where would Garrus have been in all this? Pissed, and right in the thick of it. If they'd only listened to your warnings about the Reaper's Shepherd, they might have been ready. Maybe. Hard to figure how you prepare for something like this.
General Victus. Half hour ago. Headed south. Got it. Not that easy. And the Krogan hate them both for it. Don't expect them to be fighting. Too bad. I fought with the Krogan. They're tough sons of bitches. Time. No Reapers taking this Primarch from me.
General Victus? Yes? I'm Commander Shepard of the Normandy. Not Commander. I know who you are. I can't wait to find out what brings you out here. General, you're needed off planet. I've come to get you. It will take something beyond important for me to leave my men or my Turian brothers and sisters in their fight. Primarch Fedorian is dead. You are the new Primarch. You're needed immediately to chair a summit and represent your people in the fight against the Reapers. I'm Primarch of Palavan. Negotiating for the Turian hierarchy? Yes. I've spent my whole life in the military. I'm no diplomat. I hate diplomats. War is your resume. At a time like this, we need leaders who've been through that hell. I like that. You're right. And honestly, uniting these races may take as much strength as facing the Reapers. You see this devastation, Primarch? Double that for Earth. I need an alliance. I need the Turian fleet. Give me a moment to say goodbye to my men. Seeing Palavin like this, up close, I'm afraid for my people, our home, for Thessia. Imagine if they'd listened, Shepard. If we'd been ready. Yeah, I know. But we're gonna give this everything we've got. Are you ready, Primarch Victus? One thing. Commander, I appreciate your need for our fleets, but I can't spare them. Not while my world is burning. But if the pressure could be taken off Palavin... That's a pretty tall order. We need the Krogan. I can't see us winning this thing without them. Get them to help us, and then we can help you. The Krogan? Looks like this summit just got a lot more interesting. Apologize for being so frank, Commander, but your plan feels doomed to failure. We know. We've been there before. But, Madam Counselor, let me... I'm not the only one that feels this way. The Salarian Dalatras is livid. Some of these issues are hundreds of years old. Time to let go. Perhaps. Still, we can't help but feel that this summit is a waste of your time. And we can't afford to have it waste ours. We must focus our attention on the arrival of the Reapers. So no, the Asari will not be at your summit. Our alliance would be stronger with the Krogan. You need them. We all do. Good luck, Commander. And goodbye. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCon. Commander, have you retrieved the Primarch for your summit? Yes, sir. But the Asari are staying on the sidelines. They'll regret that. The time for unity is now. The Salarians will be there, though. You don't sound very optimistic. We expect the Krogan will be joining us, too. I see. Well, then you've got your hands full, Commander. Was there something else you needed to discuss? Any updates on Cerberus? There's still the wild card here. Hitting the Archives on Mars suggests they're after the same thing we are. A way to defeat the Reapers. The elusive man implied as much. You'd think we'd be on the same side now more than ever. Cerberus has never played by the rules as we know them. I don't know what their agenda is, but it has nothing to do with humanity's best interests. The elusive man talked about controlling the Reapers. He seemed to think that's how we win this. Is wrong. Dead Reapers are how we win this. Doesn't mean he won't try. I saw your report on that Cerberus soldier you found on Mars. 
If the elusive man is good at one thing, it's finding new ways to subvert science. It's never worked for him before, and it won't now. How do you see us winning this war, Admiral? By making you the tip of the spear. I'm flattered, but the Normandy is just one ship. And a fast one. You can move quickly, hit a target, and leave before the enemy has time to react. Have you pieced together how the Reapers hit Earth? It wasn't all that complicated, really. They surged through the relays and hit Arturus Station before we knew what was happening. From there, it was a short jump to the Sol system. Earth didn't stand a chance. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out.